What is this? Crusade for the Neonity Kingdom of Romania. Launches in 10 months. Left click to open Great Holy War. Head of the Faith would be Pope Callistus III against King Reco. Oh no! Oh, that's right. They have territories in Italy. You may pledge yourself a defender. You may gain a share of the war chest piety and prestige. Oh, that actually would help. Wars against other participants will end when the crusade begins. See participants. Ansel the Knights Templar and Pope Callista III. Defenders would be King Reco of Sweden. I think we'll defend, and then if we can, we can get the piety, and that way we can try to see if we can reform Sumanusco to become an organized religion, and that way we can actually become feudal, etc., etc., etc. Yeah, let's do this. So, let's see. Holy War. Because we're actually not fighting anybody else. Let's disband this army. I'm expected to pledge military support or donate gold. How? Why? If we're victorious, I may receive part of the war chest according to my war chest. Oh, because we are Sumanusco as well. Okay. Member of my dynasty. And my house. What is... Okay, this is interesting because now this is a dynasty that's my dynasty, but it's not technically my... They're both my house and my dynasty, but it's not my... Oh, this is really interesting. So theoretically, I guess I could play as King of Sweden if for whatever reason something happened with Finland, right? Member of my dynasty. A group of noble descendants of a landed ancestor, the founder of the dynasty. The original house can split into new ones, cadet branches, all still members of the wider dynasty. When your character dies, you must have an heir of your dynasty or the game will end. Much like prestige for characters, dynasties have renown. Okay. So the dynasty is House Virtanen, right? Okay, there we go. Call to war. Okay, the enemies are the Duchy of Athens and the Duchy of uh, County of Cosenza. So we have to attack the papacy, right? <laughs> when this war begins, uh oh. Holy war for the earldom of Capua. Defending against Dukes Antiochos. Antiochos of Athens. Oh, that's right. They have a bunch of territories down here. Well, okay, this war is going to start in 10 months, so let's uh, wait for that crusade. Uh-oh. Do we have other Suomanusko kingdoms? Bjarmalan, maybe. Bjarmalan, really, and then here. All these guys. Bjarma, Ustjog, Chudia. Being raided. Get out of here, bud. Okay, so this is the first crusade that I'm going to be a part of for the anointed kingdom of Romania. What's the goal here? The sacking of Osa. What? I will avenge this slight. Vassal in the Kingdom of Estonia. Yeah, no, I will avenge that. In the meantime, let's hire... Uh, I know we can hire another men-at-arms unit. 
armored footmen, onagers. So we have onagers. We have. We don't have any pikemen, but I know we'll be facing more cavalry down in the European area of things. So let's raise this to a max. Hopefully we'll be able to afford all this. Why is our pi piety or prestige going down? Unraised men-at-arms. Under concubine limit. Held duchies, kingdoms, domain. House head, dynasty head. Peasant rabble. What and why and who's raiding? Ah. Fine, you want you want this? There we go. You should be taking care of this. This is within your kingdom. New perk for the intrigue lifestyle. Oh, we already have all of this. Ah, he's already a schemer. Fantastic. He does all of this stuff already. Oh, nice. Okay. Digging for dirt. Find secrets, progress speed, disrupt schemes, effectiveness, murder scheme, power, hostile scheme, success chance, prepared for anything. Kidnapper. Huh. <laughs> Twice schemed. Oh, this is going to be fun. Okay. Like weeds in a garden. Torture. Dark insights. 50% chance to gain either one intrigue or one prowess. Okay. Dreadful. Here we go. My, my wife, Queen Ludmilla, is with child and should be overjoyed. However, she's been acting strange. I will look into this discreetly. No, no. Uh, lost the war against Dukes Antiochus. Uh, okay, so that makes sense. Suspicions laid to rest. Oh no, very disappointed in me. Oh, come on. Launches in 55 days. Okay. Nephew Voito. Pohyanma, who are they at war with? Promote culture task. Oh, have fully embraced Finnish traditions. Oh, nice. Great work, Ihala. Now let's see. Oh, that's pretty easy. I thought it was going to be by level, so now they're just straight up Finnish. Okay. Uh, let's go here then to Viek. Neat. Okay, that's fun. Chieftain of Reval. Why is it zero? Well, we don't really have anything to gain from level of devotion. Okay. Launches in a few days. I don't know what happens when this happens. Oh, 20,000 versus 11,000. West Franconia, Provence, Urbach, Armagnac, Upper Lorraine, Beaumont, Sable, Cassel, Clotaire, Romania. I think the target's just Romania, right? The Crusade for Romania. The hordes of infidels rallied by Pope Calistus have begun their march on Romania. So it's just on Romania, not here. Their savage warriors, uh, clearly inspired by, by uh, Pahonainen, will ravage our lands and slaughter our people without mercy if we do not stop them. For the good of all Sumanusco faithful in Romania, we must prevail. Bercale, protect us. Okay, I actually don't know if there's any Suomanusko down here. Let's take a look at the... Asatru. Eh. Valdensian. Chieftain Axo of Sombio. Is there a war map? Can we just see a war map?
honestly, all I'm looking for is to raid people. Let's see. West Franconia. Prince Archbishop of Coteo. Okay, they're here. Ayaccio, that's too far south. Let's see. Is there anybody in the north? Parma, Provence, Erbach. Okay, they're a little bit closer. Armagnac. Nope. Upper Lorraine. Nope, oh, there we go. That's a nice target. Beaumont. Beaumont, there we go. Countess Bun of Beaumont. Uh, Beaumont. And it looks like there's some there's some pickings there. Okay. Crusade. The Romanian Crusade. I don't know how this is going to work. I don't know if we just need to de like defend Romania itself prematurely. Oh no. Sad face. Okay, let's take a look. Let's raise our armies here. Local levies. 2768. What happened to all of our... Why are our levies so low? Oh, uh, maybe it's because we don't have these counties that are populated yet. That sucks. Okay, let's uh, let's go ahead and raise the armies. Nice. Is that everybody? Okay, we raised all of the... I don't know why those numbers were so low for like a while. It looked like 2,400. So here are levies. Total soldiers. That's different. Okay. Now let's head to... Ah, here we go. Anything that's outlined in red. Perfect. These guys are close by. Now... Our current king has really good intrigue abilities. I've never really used these plots before. I'm very interested. Let's see if we can. <laughs> Ooh, let's see if we can run a plot here too far away to interact with, huh? Okay. Well then, since you guys were such jerks and joined this war for no reason, I'm gonna see if I can uh, murder. murder. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. I hate that. I think this is so funny, but I've never. Let's abduct her. Okay, what, what happens? Because my prisoner, however, you will be exposed for the crime of kidnapping. Don't mess with this woman who's gone then. As long as the scheme is kept secret, you're not exposed for the crime of kidnapping. Expect it to take eight years? Oh, forget it. That's way too long. That war is going to be over by then. Um, murder. How long is that going to take? 17 months. Way faster. Oh, that's, that's terrible. Okay. You know what? You guys are being jerks. You're the ones who decide to start this war. Ooh, don't make me. Don't make me pull out all the stops. You guys are jerks. Okay, let's see how long it takes for them to start ravaging this whole area here. 31. That's a decent amount of plunder. I know all they're trying to do is get Romania, and honestly, I think we're going to lose this super fast. But in the meantime, I'm going to try to plunder as much as I can. Who are these guys? Frankfurt to Erbach and Blekinger. Oh no, Havu was captured by my friend Chieftain Jurva. What? Okay, we have some idea. Well, I don't know where these guys are going. Frankfurt. Okay, how long is this going to take? Three months. I know this is theoretically going to drag out the war far longer than it probably needs to be, but I don't care because I want to try to plunder as much as I can. Um, I don't know why we can't loot this area. Do we get that? How do we loot a city? Juneg, Yerkal, okay, through downcast lashes. Hi, Chief to say you. 
my sister-in-law. Oh, no. That's... No, no, no. I don't have an idea about the fog of war about some of these armies here. They went west. I don't know where they're heading. I don't know if they're heading north. The good chiefess. While hosting lords and ladies from realms near and far, some opportunities to portray my vassal chiefess Rauha in a good life have presented themselves. My lord, pray tell who is the most noble lady person you have heard of. Chiefess Rauha, without a doubt. Need to convince her to get on. Chieftain Junek of Yarkali during the siege of Samar. That's really far east, I'm pretty sure. Nice! Count Kobo's wife, Countess Ingratude. And two others. Okay, number one, that's a great name. Ingratude, that's an amazing name. Now, we need to capture Frankfurt. Spymaster, what happened? Seppo. Oh, we don't have any eyes on the situation now. Mainz, Worms, Erbach, Kaiserslautern, Speyer, Dorda, Heilbronn. Okay, so... I just wanted to take a bunch of stuff and kind of... War chest share max, score 1278, occupation. I don't even know, how do we win this? Is Erbach well defended? Nope. <laughs> nice. Oh yes, this should be very nice. And Frankfurt is ours. Take Erbach. Now, is anybody else up here? That's the problem. I don't know if Sweden's... Okay, we have a bunch of siege engines. Just want to make sure we don't actually run into an enemy army that would be hard to overcome. Okay, we can progress into West Franconia. Right here. Well, their, their capital is not here. Oh, that's the Kingdom of Bavaria. Bavaria. West Franconia. Who's this? Prince Archbishop of West Franconia. Do they have a capital? Langenfeld. Who are we at war with? Okay, we just need to go for the shields. Let's go for the shields. The shields that are on fire. So Provence, we can go here. County Beaumont, Sable. Again, I don't know how the war is progressing down here. They're probably going to win, but in the meantime, we'll get some sweet, sweet loot. Oh, yeah, they're definitely going to win that. Can we plunder towns? I don't know how to do this. I'm going to look this up. How do you loot a town? <clears throat> I think maybe you can't loot that as an army. You might have to parade. Where else can we go? How about Trier? Is that is that good loots? Is that good looting? 18? Eh. Well, I mean, sure, why not? What else are we doing? Oh, wait. Okay, let's let's back up here. Okay, so this is all technically Swedish territory. Armagnac. Okay, here's the Swedes. We just need to carry... Okay, Armagnac. Are we at war with Armagnac? Apparently. 
Where's their... I don't know. But I know Tria for sure is at war with us, so let's go ahead and capture that. Or wait, are we still... Oh wait, did they did they fall out of the war? <laughs> I mean fall out. Did they did they leave the crusade? Because they're not outlined in red anymore. Sweden what why oh it's because I'm clicking on Amanyak. Let's click on our own allies. So our enemies are still outlined in red. Okay. Let's capture Trier and then go west. For these really developed cities, their defenses are really crap. I mean, I'm not complaining. King Vigla has lost against Hachitsu of Ruta of Kurland and the Kurland of Kakos of the county of Sebej. Okay. Oh, here's the... This is who we're fighting. Okay, let's, let's let, knock out of the... Knock all these guys out right here in Bavaria. Who's this? So, county in the kingdom of Bavaria. Can we loot the temples? I mean, it sounds like something we can do, right? Casa. Seizure. Okay, Trier. Okay. Castle holding. Castle holding. Castle holding. Why is this still 33? Urbino Casatano, Arezzo, Ravenna. Okay, so we don't actually... But we can capture a lot of nobles in the meantime, can't we? What else is good looting around here? Oh, let's go to Mainz. Can we actually capture a bishopric? Prince Archbishop is a close. Oh, oh eh, 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 slow down. Enemies left war. Uh, Prince Archbishop of Clotel Westphalm Cronia left crusade. Oh, Marshal earns respect, but but only because natural causes. So I don't know if anointed West Franconia. Are we still? Oh, oh, okay. So we're not at war with these guys anymore. Who does this belong to? West Francia. Well then, let's head west. Uh, actually, we probably are not in a bad position here, actually. Uh, Dana Swedish subjugation war. Wait, allies, enemies would be Kingdom of Denmark and the King Kingdom of Vestland. Uh, okay. <sighs> okay. Uh, let's say accept. Oh, sure. Every nook and cranny, a dark night can truly make the shadows of my castle's hallways come alive. The perceived risk for unsanctioned visitors rise ever higher for every unguarded corner spotted. If I alone can see this many faults, imagine what more people with a similar perspective could do. I will hire a just group of discreet agents. Okay, so we da uh, uh oh, this is rough. Now, if we just kind of lose this war really quickly. Uh, blank, blank, died, leaving Romani to be claimed by the holiest warrior. What happened? Pope Urbanos replaced King Bishop Calixtus, Calixtus of the third, uh, the third of the papacy. Every nook and cranny. Okay, so this is what you should do. Tulitar, an expert in the discreet arts, has been all over my castle, scar uh, scaring both servant and courtier alike when emerging from the darkest of corners. Huddled around her notes, a detailed plan for increased security is slowly taking form. Tulitar Sudanma leaves your court. I might have someone, uh, a use for someone of your talents. There we go.
Oh, wait, how did Sweden get these? Huh? Prince Archer, okay. My spies have informed me about a hunter causing a ruckus at the local tavern. The man has been spending large amounts of gold and bragging loudly about the great deal he stuck with a fancy lord in pearls and silk. Apparently he knew a, he drew a map of the local taiga for an unknown nobleman. The spies think the lord must be scheming against me or one of my subjects. Thanks for bringing this to my attention. Who's Turu? Turu. Beaumont. Let's capture Beaumont and then Sable. Oh, who's this? Oh, Denmark. Okay, so I guess we need to, like, capture this and then leave. We're pretty much going to lose this war anyway. I just wanted to get some good loot. So once we're here, we'll capture that and then head north. And we can actually go straight here for Denmark. Maybe go to Hjelland. Directly for the castle. Who is this controlled by? Jarl Tosta the second Uvasonman. Uvason of Man. Okay, Sub is gonna get away with it. 36, actually that's a lot. But it's more important that we get back here before they Ooh, they're gonna take all of this stuff. That's not great. Who's this? Neutral rating. Sweden's got to have a few more allies, right? I mean, where's... Okay, number one, where did the capital of Sweden go? Oh, it's from here. Rauham, more susceptible lines, hands approaching her, I can include a compliment. Clear rationality. What is her... callous, diligent, gluttonous? Sure. Countess Bond's grandson, Othon, and her daughter-in-law, Emma, during the siege of Beaumont. Now let's head over here to Denmark. Dietmarschen, Kleber. Oh yeah, no, Itzehoe. Wait, who's raiding Itzehoe? Oh, they're gonna run out of. They're not. There's not gonna be any more loot. Oh well. We should head straight here anyway. Link curbing. Second? Who else is in this war? Dark insights. So dark, that's a dark pathway there. But you know what? Okay, who are these guys? Erbach, Beaumont, Ayaccio. Okay, so they're gonna go back and recapture all that. But we're far away and now we're capturing, or at least trying to take. Ulvila, or Rinkeborg. Linkubbing. Really, we should take Oddborg. That is a large army. How many men do they have? 7,000 soldiers. Can we call on anybody else? Clamanda Pinteramo. 400? Oh, wait, who? Who is this? Prisoner. Spouse is Ganadios of Smolian. Uh, okay, sure. Um, yeah, give me 100 gold. Wow. Rosina Makidon for 100. Who is this? Wow, these ransoms are amazing. We should just kidnap people all the time. Uh, Gungrad, okay, no. Who's this? No. Orthon Chalon Sancerre. 10. Eh, sure. Lawfully imprisoned Chieftain Lauri Mesukula. Attempted to murder family member?
All of she's in Lauri's family. Well, uh, come back to that later. Karina. Doesn't Karina already have a guardian? Oh, that's right. Um, take concubine. How many children do we have right now, anyway? We have a couple and we have a son. Okay, I'm not going to take a prisoner. Tulitar Sudanma. Eh. Things we know. I'd be lying if I said it was not a little pleasing to see the way Chieftain Ihala scorned when I let him knew what I knew. Know what I knew. Take me aside in private. My brother wants to know what he can do about it. I don't forgot what the secret was. High Chieftain Olavi gains 20 opinion. Yes. Who else are we at war with? It's... Who? Anlaufer Anlaufsson of Veslon. Where is he? Ah, Veslon. You should just go there. He only has one territory, doesn't he? He has six tiles. Never mind. The Isles. Oh, okay. Veslon's over here. But we can capture his capital easily. So after we're done with this, head up to Bergen, it looks like. Yethar. Karina, yes. Uh oh. Captured by Se Chieftain Satatia. Who is capturing all of my. Oh, they're my vassals just fighting each other. Stop it! All of you. Why are these territories ruler High Chieftain Penti of Pohyanma? All these different colors. I'm not sure what's happening here, but... Yethar. So we should capture Yethar pretty easily. Novgorod's capital is still here. I don't get that. Habu Virtanen left the prison. Obviously, this can go on for quite a while. So I think once we capture Yetar, we'll go ahead and take a break for today. This has been f super fun. Um, yes, it'll be interesting to see what happens next. I know we're theoretically still fighting for this um, holy war. In Romania? Okay. High Chieftain An Laufur's mother, Anna, during the siege of Yetar. Mureferen Blekinger. Now, let's... How many... He has... 3726, so that's a lot of men. I don't know if he himself, the Tribal Kingdom of Denmark, actually has that many soldiers... But this is a pretty powerful ally, so... Oh, we're actually good on even 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 number of people. So let's go ahead, since we already have the advantage here, let's go west to Veslon. Capture some of these guys. Okay, where can we get some of the loot? Pickens are kind of slim over here. Ulster. Brechna. Brechna. Dublin. Brechna is good. Oriel Ulster. Yeah, that's better than Alborg. Okay, actually, Alborg is good. Let's go with Alborg. 
Ah, uh, they're level five. Over the years, I've received a great deal of portraits from various noble women, both foreign and local. Until now, they mostly gathered dust in some attic. Perhaps I should bring them out and select my next romantic pursuit? I can picture myself as someone new. They're too pretentious for my taste. Yeah. Aarhus. Viborg. Nice. Okay, now let's uh, promote more culture here. It has come to my attention that some local commoners are moving to Vipuri, the capital of my ch vassal chiefess Rauha. Locals newly settled or not, praising me can surely do no harm to a reception of me. Take this gold, make sure you're heard. Also. Oh, Ludmilla's pregnant. Fantastic. And these guys are going into the water, so I think they're leaving. Who are all these people just raiding? So I think they might be trying to come back. Uh-oh. Okay, the Swedes are coming back. We should probably try to help them out. Rauha's suede. Marshall impresses vassal. This is rough. We need to capture Hjellan. Roskil. Uh -uh. Oh no, 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 that's bad. My noidi Aidna is really getting on my nerves. Not a moment goes by she isn't droning on and on about Uko and his will. Uh, yeah. I will make her the laughing stock of Ulvila. Vaina Moinen must have aided me because my plan went even better than expected. While Aidna was sleeping, I slipped a rat between her sheets. I barely had time to hide before she woke with a scream, threw herself out of bed, and ran out the door, naked as the day she was born. It was the only thing my courtiers talked about last night. Aidna will never leave this down. Serves her right. Gained trickster for 10 years. Lost 35 stress. Uh oh, I don't like that's rough. We can't lose the subjugation war. If they're subjugated to Sweden, that means our closest neighbor is going to be part of Denmark, and that's not great. Who is Viken beholden to? Are they independent? They are. Yes. Control Avo. Fin. Oh, let's go to Fin. What? Who is this? Leader Onni of the Peasant Revolt. Oh, come on. Uh, okay, fine. Tax lien. Who is this? Vidalist. Okay, that's fine. Tidbush from far away. Come closer, my lord. Marvel at treasures never before seen in these lands. I had to blend into the populace to get these beauties out. Truly a harrowing experience. The merchant might have more to give to me than marvels from afar. Must be interesting traveling as much as you do. This should cover both trinkets and information. Vesa and Herta, that's right. Child's Heritage Secret. Oops. Oh, no. That army, okay. Elusive Shadow, nice. Plus eight. 
Now, it is harder to say, however, everything that is asked of her is done by others before she gets to it. She never fa uh, tells petty lies the way she used to. Perhaps she was not as clever as she seemed after all. Hmm. Okay. Well, that they are... Nope. Let's, uh, let's get out of here. Oh, yikes. Yeah, yeah, nope. That's terrible. Bad defeat there. Uh-oh. What just happened? Lots of bad stuff just happened, I think. It looks like... Okay, yeah, that's fine. Hola, V. Oh, no, lost 10 stress. Oh, that's right, because I didn't quite like them. And that makes it a little bit easier. Allied combatants captured. My courtier Swain was taken before, uh, by my foe, King Ulfur, after he won the Battle of Taulov. Oh no, was he my champion? And allied combatant slain. High Chiefs and Olavi. Half-brother. I was trying to make him like me. Uh, okay. Well, who's going to be the leader here? Faction who installed Seppo on the Finnish throne has disbanded. Okay, so now who... High Chief and us... Kiko of Savo, nephew. Let's uh, sway. I don't know why these characters just don't like me. Obviously, that was a terribly, terrible battle. High Chiefs and Penti. Who was he? Grandson of Chieftain Penti. Okay, our armories are here. We need to just retreat. Well, actually, let's uh, let's go west. They won't come after us there. Do we have any armies to replenish with? That's the problem. Unraised soldiers too. Obviously not the case. Okay, you know what? Here's the thing. We have to plot. This is not going to go well if we don't. So let's do this. And by plot, I think we all know what that is covered language for, or uh, covert language for. Doo -doo. <laughs> we, you know what? We can't. We can't take... We're obviously losing, and if they win, they're going to subjugate Sweden. And that's not great. So we're going to pull out all the stops here. Fifty fifty percent chance of succeeding. Oh. Yeah, well. Wrath of the Cross. Spectacular must have abandoned Kireko to allow his army to be so thoroughly defeated by the soldiers of the cross. Following their successful crusades, the heathens have occupied Romania and have claimed the surrounding territory's rightful Catholic land. Okay, that's fine. I'll stay for a while. Samugitia. Okay. I can help out with the dining hall. I don't know why this isn't progressing. 
chest of gold is very unguarded. Now it's time for bed. Why isn't this progressing? Zero out of ten. Success chance. Secrecy. Oh, there we go. Hmm. You really fixed the place up. Glad I was able to help. Endless hearings. Not a day goes by without some new inconsequential matter brought to my attention in the court. Today, it seems like Chieftain Lauri's and Chieftain Ak uh, Asiko's turn to waste my time with a petty dispute. It would be, have me believe that this is an issue placing the very safety of the realm at risk, yet I cannot shake the feeling that they were largely overestimating the severity of the situation to feed their own ego. Guards, get these ruffians out of my sight. No. I will teach you to waste the course time. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let me hear this one more time. <clears throat> the core of the issue between Lauri and Asiko, uh, Asiko is related to some squabbling between the commanders and a few veterans of the army. If nothing else, I can see Lauri is the, by far the most grating of the two petitioners. Asiko's words ring true to my ears. Siege of Kerlingfjörður. Oriel. Wait, is this Oriel? I don't even know how we fight back against that. We have so few troops compared to them. I also need to do something about Chieftain Satadia, though. He is getting super... Super graspy. Can I do multiple plots? Inspire moderation. Overreaching can be terribly dangerous. There we go. I mean, can't we just <laughs> go, go just not batch it crazy, but just be like, okay. Divine retribution. Enticing opportunity, like weeds in a garden. Thriving in chaos, divine retribution. See thriving in chaos. Oh, we could just run a whole bunch of them. Well, in that case. Oh, 41. Oh, no.
Oh, invite. Wait, wait, wait. What's this? Invite agents to scheme. Wait, wait, wait. What's happening here? Call to war. Anglo-Saxon Asatsu Uprising. Okay. Uh, low control. Task finished. You joined a war. Wait, what is this agent's bit? Can be convinced. Bribe? 31. No, use a hook. Oh, okay. This is terrible, but uh, not really. <laughs> this is horrible and also very interesting. Okay. <laughs> Terrible. I feel bad, but at the same time, it's like, dude, we're obviously going to lose this war if we don't do anything. Who are we at war with again? These guys. Uprising enemy army, that's right. Okay, here we go. The time has come. My agents are in place. One of them will pay the assassin the very night the deed will happen. Another will ensure the wall is unguarded. A third will leave a subtle rail of candles to King Ulfr's bedchamber. Everything is in place. Do it. Success. I don't know. Oh. Oh, it's worked. I've covered my tracks well. If anyone suspects me for being behind the attack, no one dares say it out loud. I do love surprise visits. Ho, oh, oh, ho, scandalous. King Philip Ulfersson of Denmark. Uh, yeah, like, take him out then. <laughs> oh, I feel terrible, but at the same time, this is kind of fun. Is there anybody else who wants to join in that scheme? Can we convince High Chieftain Andre As Askeres of Sleswick? One hundred twelve. Forget it. Can be convinced, Lenart. Yep. Let's do it. Adleta. Yep. Because then I don't even know who it's going to pass on to. Oh, it's going to be passing on to Chieftain Gorm Totil son of Fin. Well, actually, no. Take him. Let's uh, let's end that. End that. Hmm. Keep it going. Oh no. Captured by my friend Chieftain Yorva. People are just getting captured left and right here. Who's this?
And where are these armies going? Okay, the uprising is going all the way to Sweden. I find that hard to believe. Okay. What is his character? Paranoid? No, he's paranoid. Feed into that. to find a good place to pause here i think this is good otherwise i'm just going to keep playing and keep playing um we have a couple of really interesting plots happening i don't know if that's actually going to affect the war here with sweden but uh if anything we'll be able to shake the monarchy down or uh shake it apart it's actually kind of falling apart to some other people here who's occupied by chief gorm turtleson of finn county holders chief and andre Askeres of Slesvig. okay so they're kind of at war with each other a bunch of vassals are now kind of fighting each other, it seems like. Um, which is not terrible. Takes the pressure off of these guys. Now, who's this? The Vestlandians and the Kingdom of Denmark are the ones who are feeling the largest armies here. So we actually can't do anything about this, but it feels like... This seems like it's a good situation. They're falling apart. We've captured Vestland. Um, we actually might have a pretty decent... Uh, hold on most of their territories here. If we capture the Inner Hebrides, Argyle, and the Outer Hebrides, and then capture Dublin, I don't know what other territories they might have outside of... Uh, actually, they might just be completely out of the war. And that'll be interesting to pick up on. So, yeah, it's been great. I think this will be going to be a good place to stop. Overwhelmed by stress, but you know, in some cases, this actually works for him. Because remember, as his trait, he actually gets a plus to that. Um, because of his intrigue tree. So it was an intrigue of 23. This guy's a pretty, uh, pretty boss. Oh no. Yes, pretty boss uh, at plotting here. So there's a bunch of stuff going on domestically here, which is not really too much of my concern. So we'll see what happens. So at the map right now, looks pretty interesting. We'll see what happens next time. Thanks for hanging out. It's been great. I'll see you then.